during the European session, the Bitcoin price prediction hasn't changed much today, as Bitcoin continues to trade above the major support level of $16,550. Given the bullish technical indicators, the market is waiting for a key on-chain signal before launching into a classic bull market. On December 17, the developer of the Puel Multiple tweeted that he believes the current Bitcoin price decline is nearing its end. However, not everyone is pessimistic about Bitcoin's future, even though many are predicting new lows of $12,000 or less this cycle. Looking at Dogecoin's chart, it seems as though it's currently going through a bearish reversal as recent gains make way for a slide into losses. Its relative strength index, purple, has fallen from 60 at the start of December to under 40 today, and it looks as though it will continue falling in the near term. At the same time, Doge's 30-day moving average, red, has plateaued after recent rises and it looks like it will begin falling toward its 200-day average, blue. If it sinks below the longer-term average, this could signal a bigger sell-off. In an interview with CNBC's Squawk Box on December 15, Novigrad said not every crypto boss is trying to steal users' money, and that not all crypto platforms are managed the way FTX was governed. Cardano's price has fallen significantly in the past few days, even experiencing a loss of over 4% in the past 24 hours. It has now dropped below the key support level of 30 cents, causing concern among some traders. If the moving average convergence divergence MACD indicator indicates a sell signal, overhead pressure will likely increase. This will signal to investors to intensify their selling efforts would be shown by the MACD, shown in blue, crossing below the signal line, shown in red, 